Hello, my friends. Welcome back to my blind Let's Play Shadow Hearts 2. Or Shadow Hearts Covenant. Whichever one you prefer. My name is Fuzz Burr. This is your Storybeast Gaming Channel. And today we are going to uh, look through this uh, wine cellar. I believe that's where we're at. We got Joachim. 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 Uh, as our avatar right now. And we will be flopping between parties, by the way. I think I may do that like after every fight or so just to you know keep it interesting okay so that entire thing just looped me around and there was a way to go up we do know there's enemies in here it's surprised we haven't had one yet I hope you're all having a wonderful fantastic day today are there enemies in here you know, there may not be enemies in here, because the enemy, uh, the, the, the encounter that we had wasn't a random encounter. It was a, you know, it was a scripted one. Alright, so let's, as soon as I say that. I like that pose that Joaquim does there to start the fight. That's pretty cool. All right, we have, yep. Basically all uh, thugs and stuff. I'm gonna go ahead and try for the combo here again. And I'm gonna try to do better than I did yesterday. Because yesterday was a mess. Oh my gosh, I could not hit Joaquim at all on anything that guy did. Uh, Alright, uh, let's see here. Uh, let's do a holy cast of those two. <sighs> I don't know why I talk. I, I don't know why I say anything. Uh, every single time I say something, something bad happens. I should just learn to just shut my mouth and keep my mouth shut. I had totally forgotten that uh, Jebedo has the, uh, the slower ring on, and that really messed me up. Okay, let's not do the combo anymore. Instead, let's go for uh, let's go for Rexes here. You see, I have uh, the thing on Geppetto. Oh my lord! I take one day off to rest myself in my brain because I'm so tired from all the stuff I've had to deal with work. And I come back and I have two straight misses. Oh man, come on Fightless Bird, get your game together. Oh my lord, what is wrong with you? Flightless, thank you. Holy cow. Just amazing. Whoa. <laughs> All right. Well, let's try to get back on a good footing, shall we? I didn't mention this the other day though, that I really like how the combat system in Shadow Hearts works because it's not just simply mashing, you know, an attack button over and over and over again to attack an enemy. You, you literally have to have some skill or you can lose to the most basic enemy. And that's really, really cool. Oh, God. Have I ever? Yes, I have hit with with the. Maybe I should get off the technical wings. No, no, no. I gotta, I gotta stick with them. I gotta keep practicing. Oh man. Whew. Well, that was messy as can be, but we got through it. I definitely need to get better at these uh, judgment ring things. Um, 
Capello. Okay, uh, let's go ahead and search Team B. And we got a Bodhi bracelet. Or a body bracelet. Uh, the Bodhi, by the way, B-H-O-D-I, uh, is the name of the tree that the Buddha sat under when he, when he reached enlightenment, uh, after being tempted by the, uh, the Mara sisters? Uh, there's, like, what, three women who tempted him? I'm not, I'm not entirely sure the story works, but, anyway. Uh, let's see here. Bracelet made from the bark of the body tree of Holy Behem. Okay, so, yeah, it's made from the body tree. The magic power of the tree and the faith of the pilgrims help prevent paralysis. Okay, so who needs that most? Probably Geppetto. What do I want to get rid of? An extra attack? Yeah, probably. I mean, he's the one that probably least uses attack magic due to him constantly um, using Holy Crest. Uh, got a couple of characters here that have low MP. Is there anything else here, though? Checking all the corners. No, I don't see anything. All right, well, you know, hey, we came all this way and we got an item and that, oh, we got two items. Uh, seal of Wisdom. So the seals, I believe, increase your uh, base stats. And uh, if you remember Shadow Hearts 1, we didn't use those until like the end of the game. I may use them a little bit earlier this time, but I gotta make sure that I'm, I, I think I'm gonna wait until I have a full party and then I'll use them. Or I can hold off to the end of the game and when we go fight any of the super bosses, if there are any, and uh, try to figure out what is the party that I want to use to fight the boss. And then use those items on the party that I want. Yeah, that may be what I do. The further they go, the more the atmosphere seems to change. You're right. This atmosphere is aroma aromatic, spicy, and pungent. A medium-bodied atmosphere with a crisp finish. That was kind of poetic, Yuri. Yeah, exactly. What was that? Uh, what the heck did you say? Ah, just be careful, that's all. <laughs> that's exactly what I was thinking. I was like, what? Alright, um... I'm gonna go right first, because it seems like the game wants me to go left. I don't see anything back here. And what about over here? Surprisingly, ah, oh, there we go. I knew there had to be something. Got a mana seed. Good, 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 good. And anything in the back corner? Nope. What's this? Move the switch. Oh, okay. And there's another switch here. And it looks like that unlocked the door. I didn't even know the door was locked. I was just searching the room. Uh, another chest. Fantastic. I uh, got a lottery ticket. Cool. I know I always say left is always right, but this game has a way of like reversing my thoughts and making it opposite from what it is. Oh man, these things are absolutely disgusting looking. Oh, come on, Footless Bird. Gotta do better than this, buddy. And of course we miss. Huh? Yep, that was the thing I happened. We missed. Can I hit both of those? I cannot. Darn it! It's really hard to hit strikes when the ring goes slow because you over anticipate. And by over anticipating, you can easily. Why can't I hit that first one? It just pops out of the box so quick. It is really, 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 really hard to hit Joe Keem's uh, first hit. I think someone just got paralyzed. Yeah, it did. Yeah, Yuri's paralyzed. That's not good. Uh, da -da -da -da. 
it's, it's so hard to go for the uh, for the reds when the minions are. It, it just throws your wall. All right, immediate. God, why can't I get his? This is so hard to do. Because it's like immediate, and then it's a short pause. Uh, Geppetto just died. I can't. I can't. I can't seem to get Yokin at all. He is completely messing me up. Alright, well, we reduced this guy's physical defense, which is good. But it doesn't matter if I don't hit. Can't hit! I can't hit with him! Why not? What is wrong with me? I wish it was like a practice mode in this game where you could just practice to win the judgment ring of a character over and over and over again because it is, he is just throwing me off. I mean, I may not use Eokim like at all in this game if I can't, if I can't get his judgment ring down. But, I mean, that would kind of be admitting defeat one in it. Yeah, it would. I don't want to do that. Alright, well, let's uh, continue on. We're going to go back and to the left. That's a, that's a bad thing. When you take a day off, it's really like taking two days off, you know, because I have, like, a break in between. Why can I not hit guys? I mean, look how close together they are and you can't hit them. Wow, look at that defense. Yeah, these guys are like rock solid or something. Those guys have such high, strong defenses. Finally! And he misses. He missed. Out of all that, I finally get an attack off, and he missed. Yeah, it's pretty smart in this game to be able to chain things together. It's very, very annoying. Uh, can we go for a, um, a Hori Fuck? Uh, it's not gonna be very helpful, is it? Mm. Alright, let's see what the big guy can do against these things. Man, it's those. Why are there enemies this early in the game that have incredibly high physical defense? And when I say incredibly high, I mean ridiculously high. Missing. I think this game may be harder than uh, Grindia 2's hard mode, by the way, with the way we're going. Because if I can't get this judgment ring to work on technical, that's gonna make every single combat a lot more difficult to win because every single combat is going to have multiple misses when I should be hitting, um, you know, and things like that. There we go. Finally. All right, we're up to 21 souls. I think I need uh, 40 for the next 40 or 60. It's one of the two. Let's, uh... So is this gonna loop back around? You don't have to check. Yeah, you have to check to see. 
All right, chance for a first strike, but are they going to be lined up for me? Sort of. So good. Spur, just shush. Stop talking. Every single time you talk, bad things happen. Again, I forgot Geppetto's thing is slower. I have to remember that. And of course, we miss. These guys have a really high evade and defensive Keep your rating. Eyes where they belong. All right, yeah, we got it. We got to make sure there's nothing else um, over here, because there could always be. See, there's a door here. Is this locked? No, it's not. Which way do you want to go? Do you want to go this way or to the left? Um. I kind of want to go back the other way first because if I'm thinking of map design, we came up and then there was a way to go left and a way to go left. The first way to go left would shoot you out to that door to your left. The second left wouldn't shoot you out to the door to the left. And normally, the way maps are designed, the further you go in a dungeon, the more likely you're going to get to the end of the dungeon. So we need to go back the other way. Ah, that's unfortunate. So many would like to kill him. Wait a minute. It's just, it's just not working for me today. See, that's how I remember. Slow ring. How do I have the slow ring? Be patient. Wow, that did a lot. Come on, you king. There we go. One is the loneliest number that we've ever seen. <laughs> yeah, I should have let him finish his uh, dialogue. I didn't realize he was saying something we haven't heard before. All right, let's go to the left here. And instantly I see a chest on the bottom left. There is he. I also see a ladder going up and a possible item over here. Oh, hello. It's not an item, it's a switch. Okay. I was expecting to find an item, not a uh, a switch. I mean, this game loves to hide like random things in corners that aren't in chests. So you always gotta loop around and try to find everything if you can. I love how the combat transitions. It's very smooth. All right, let's see here. Let's go back to Rex's. All right, good start. Also a good start. Okay, not as good as I wanted, but still not bad. Now you may say, why didn't I finish that guy off? For some reason, it's because I believe Geppetto can finish him off. Yep. Uh, Geppetto needs a heal after this.
Okay, so far, yeah, I mean, I'm getting back in the hang of it, but I'm still struggling. Uh, it's just one of those things where, you know, you just gotta keep at it and don't give up. Uh, I'm not gonna give him a mana leaf yet. Check this corner. See a chest over there. We'll come back to that one. I almost expect that floor to fall out from underneath me. I mean, it's completely different from every other floor. Alright, what does this item do? Uh, decorate it with the silver disc, posture of mirror shine, looking into the mirror comes the soul, enables the wearer to fight with full mental strength. What the heck does that mean? Stops mental break. Alright, well maybe we should give that to Karen, since, since she's the, uh, the one with the lowest SP. And the poison will give to, uh, you King because he's got an open slot for an accessory. All right, let's look back around. Did I change uh, my team from the last combat? I don't remember. I'll change it just to make sure. I really like how easy it is to change your team. So nice, such a good change. More RPGs need something like that. All right, uh, let's see, Gale Spin. Once again, look how close they are to each other. I mean. I can literally see the orange in that thing's disgusting little head, and yet for some reason I can't hit it. Alright. Oh, that was close. Yeah, the reason I did the uh, attack with Blanca is because I don't think Blanca's powerful enough to take it out. I want to try Poirot. It's kind of funny because in Legend of the Guy, Poirot was a uh, dark element type. And in this game, Poirot is this brilliant angel. That was cool. I like that move. That was very nice. I am super disappointed that I can't hit multiple targets of those, but you know, we got it. Oh, that was cool. Oh, that was so neat. Is it over already? Flinging like fire, well, light balls or whatever you want to call them. Plasma energy, energy balls. I mean, that was super duper cool. Uh, I really, 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 really enjoy that attack. All right, save point. It's kind of good timing since I need a mana leaf on everyone. Although with the save point, I can just go ahead and use a tent. Also drop a save. And try not to totally mess up this next combat. Which, eh, easier said than done, right? Let's switch here. Need to run around. I really wish I would put the save point on the other side rather than on that side. Because you have to do some running around in order to uh, get these things down. And if you lose the fight against the boss, you're gonna have to do this all over again or you have to drop another save. But I'm pretty sure there's still one more switch to be activated. Over here. Okay, that was interesting. Why did it just do that? I honestly don't know. That was... What was the point of that switch? 
Oh well. I'm gonna drop another save just so if we die, we don't have to do all that over again. And let's uh, proceed on with uh, what I'm expecting is gonna be a boss fight here. Huh? Uh, oh right, uh, superhero. Huh? It's the mayor and cool. Guys are knocked out. Cole, the vigilante leader. He's desperately trying to pretend he's unconscious. <laughs> he's breathing, so he can't be dead. So are they just waiting on wait for me? Oh, it's Veronica. Oh, this ain't good. Oh boy, she's back. Joachim! Big brother! Uh, oh, you two, all right. We're getting you out of here right now. Ho, ho, ho. I knew you fools would show up sooner or later. Uh, who, who are you? I am afraid I played a trick on that idiot mare. I use these little ones as bait to get you to come. Oh, uh, so that weird atmosphere we were feeling was you, huh? Hee <laughs> hee I suppose so. Now get ready to take your punishment. I was expecting a combat. What just happened? You with the silly outfit, how dare you take my family? I, Joachim, will make you pay for your crimes! Ah! Silly outfit, huh? Ah, my name is Veronica, if you must know. But the time for talk is over! Look at that stance. Yeah! Yucky! Big brother! Toy kids. What is he doing? Huh? Oh, it's his mask. That's what he needs for his, uh... To become the Grand Papillon. What's going on? Champion of truth and justice. Grand Papillon. Ready to fight all evil doers. I love the music. How is, it, how is it this game can go from super serious to incredibly goofy at like the flip of a hat? It's so amazing. Okay, this looks like a one-on-one -on -one fight, which... Um... If it was defense, I'll go defense. But I don't know if this... I don't know what she's gonna hit me with. She may hit with that dark vision. Oh my god! There's no way I'm gonna win this boss battle. There's no way I don't want, I'm going to what? This is a nightmare, my friends. This is like the worst possible thing that could have happened. Let's keep that uh, muscle art up. I mean, this is a net loss, but it's keeping us going.
Maybe not, and that also was a uh, perfect. Yeah, wow, that's a lot more damage. It's like 33% more. So she seems to counter what I do. When I attack with physical, she attacks with physical. When I attack with a special, she attacks with a special. Yes. Okay, um, should I mana leap here? Or should I just go in for attacks? Considering how bad I am with physical attacks with Yeo King, I think going with a mana leap here is probably the best thing we could do. Wow, we actually got another turn too. what you call attacking your strategy, my friends. You realize that you completely stink at doing the uh, judgment ring? So you switch over to something that you know you can do. And until Flutter's Bird opens up his mouth. And, um, and, uh, does that. I'm so glad that special attack down hasn't hit. Because if it has hit, we'd be in a lot of trouble. So here's the bottom line. If I hit next turn, I win. If I don't hit next turn, there's a chance we could lose. I did it. Oh, I did it. The final battle is still to come. Good job, Grand Papillon. I like how his name changed to Grand Papillon. Not too shabby, Masked Wonder. Ha 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 ha! No evildoer can stand against my rippling muscles! Well, I hate to get myself all sweaty. Here, I've got a present for you. Uh-oh. Oh, what is this? Oh my god, what is that? Uh, that thing looks pretty tough. You think? Come on, we've got to help. Do we really have to get in the middle of this one? <laughs> oh, that was great. I love that. Oh, I love that. I love it. I love it. I love it. All right, so Yokim is already starting out the battle hurt. So what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to go uh, Arex is here. And I'm going to start the fight with... I'm going to start the fight with the Hell's Eyes. Okay. Um, you are going to try to kill this thing. Good job. Oh, and he missed! Oh, but still defeated, thanks to the perfects. Um, you are going to... You're going to Crest Magic. And you're going to Surge... Geppetto. Geppetto, you're going to start off by curing Eokim. that thing okay now what I have to do is I have to get Geppetto to be the last character in my rotation so what I need to do is I need a combo hmm. I need her to attack I'll go ahead and surge up Araxis. Ah! 
And then what we'll do is we'll have everyone go to Karen. Okay, good. No paralysis, but that really did stink because he hit Karen, which is not good. Uh, Alright, so what are we going to do here? Um, uh, I want to attack, but I don't want to miss. I had sweaty palms on that one, I will admit. Alright, pop this ugly fog up, and then we'll go with Odaxis. Because you have anti-air. Now it's not anti-air, but it is a knockdown. All right, and then we'll go to Yerokim. And I really don't want to take the chance on. Oh man. Oh, I'm gonna have to take the chance. Please, Yeo Kim, please. No! Oh my goodness, why can't I? Why can't I hit Yeo Kim's regular attack? Why is it so dang hard? All right, once again, Geppetto is at the end of the line, which sucks. All right, uh, let's pure leaf Karen. And then we'll combo on Karen. Because she used an item, I guess she acts faster, which is good. Rexus got the first shot. He's going to Hell's Eyes. Uh, we'll have Joachim go next. And you're going to Drain Touch. Wait, what happened to the combo? Where did my combo go? How? What? Why? Why did that work as a combo? I don't understand that one. Is it because it was a heal, but it was an attack at the same time? All right, that's bad with a capital B A D. Uh, I need a um. Uh, soul Benediction on Arexis. Okay. So you should attack, Karen should attack, and then Arexis should combo up on Geppetto? No, it doesn't matter. Everyone should just go ahead and attack this round. Alright. Why do I have to make this game so much harder than it is? Like, seriously. And Karen got... So now I can't try for my... Uh... I've been trying to do the combo magic with Geppetto, but I can't seem to get him as the final character because every single turn, something happens that throws me off. Oh, that, that's really helpful. Surge effect is gone. Let's 
I think I actually do better when I don't try the combo. But I want to try the combo because I want to see what it looks like. Because it looks amazing. You know? Oh, great. I didn't realize that each turn he loses 4 SP. I thought he just loses 1 SP each turn. Oh, man. That's not good. And, of course, we miss. Come on, you guys. We need to stop this fog out, like, right now. Holy cast. Berserk movie music makes everything like more intense. Please don't use a special item. Good. Bad. Really, really, really bad. That's good. Oh, I like that little cut to her face. That was neat. There we go. Alright, well that was that was a train wreck. But we got through it! We got through it! A true hero never loses! And we got the item of Sayos. Oh man, that was that was a disaster. Well, you see. Yeah, what do I see? Uh, I'm very sorry, I'll never do anything like that again, I swear. And you're to stay away from the sequel from now on, you hear? Yes, ma'am. Anything. I owe my life to all of you. I'll never let my greed get the better of me or bother anyone ever again, I promise. Oh, uh, yeah, right. Well, I'll forgive you this time on one condition. A condition? I hope it's nothing too difficult. Yikes. Mayor. Uh, we need to take a ship to England. Uh, you don't need me to spell it out for you, do you? No, no, sir. I'll, we'll, I'll make all the rangers. Just lead them to me. All right, well, we got ourselves a ship. And let's check out this crest. Oh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. We have a couple crests. Where did these come from? Zapar, Zitri. Show its turn interval. Okay, who wants that? I'm gonna give that to her. And I'm gonna give Blanca the attack up because he's super duper fast. And I'll give. A Geppetto, a Zephyr. All right, cool. Hey, hey, hey! Thanks again for saving us. I asked. I talked to Mirko. It's all range. I'm glad I could do something to help. Ha ha ha! Yeah. Oh boy. This is this is this is not the start to Shadow Hearts two that I wanted. Um, but you know what? It, it, it's all right. It, it's. It's one of those things where the difficulty that I'm imposing on myself by not being good at this game is actually making the game a lot more intense than what it should be. And that makes it a lot of fun, too. Because if the game is super easy, uh, it, it can get, you know, it can get less interesting. Uh, especially when it comes to combat. Because if combat is super duper easy, um, the combat's not gonna be as much fun. Uh, can I change my party configuration now for without Yerokim and party? I can, okay. So, how do I want this? I want to make sure I'm using everyone as equally as possible. Um, what I could do is I could have, like, a sliding... ...rotation. 
Blanca's in every party. Geppetto's only in one party. So I have Blanca in two, Karen in three, Geppetto in two, and uh, Yeokim in two. I'd rather have... Yeah, I'd rather have Karen in the most parties out of all three of them. Um, it looks like once we get another character, we should be able to balance it out a bit more. And I definitely want Yuri in all the parties. Although there's going to be a, come a time when we're going to have enough party members where we're probably going to want to switch out uh, Yuri to... Uh, to, you know, just make sure we're using everyone as much as we can. Yeah, I need to do some shopping. Um, probably not for weapons or armor, but I would like to get a few more tents. And... Um, a few more Phoenix Tails. And I think that should be good. Let's go for the 20, see how it is. Not bad. I think in the uh, the original Shot Hearts, we couldn't get past 30% without messing up. You know, oftentimes I would like to do 20% just because I can't do 30%. Let's go ahead and stop in here to talk to everyone before we leave. Ah, there you all are. I've been waiting for you. The mayor came by and apologized. He promised to leave the shop alone from now on. I feel so much better now. Uh, did he really? He sure did. Said he'd never forget about that treasure buried uh down there too. Now I can relax and think about business. We're so glad, Granny Lot. And we're getting that ship right we want to. It all worked out great. Thank you for everything you've done. I'll be praying for your safe travel. Stop by if you ever come back this way again, Yeokim. The children I would all love to see you again. Granny, I want to talk to you. Ah, what is it? I'm going on that ship with them. <laughs> what? I want to travel and build up my skills and who knows? Maybe I'll run into teacher somewhere along the way. Teacher. Okay, so maybe he's not the gold bat from the original Shadow Hearts. Maybe his teacher is the gold bat from the original Shadow Hearts. Are you very sure you want to come along? Because I know I've seen that golden bat before. There aren't any bad guys left in this town. My work here is done. Granny here rescued me once I was left for dead by the side of the road. I'm grateful, but now it's time to go. All right, Joachim. I remember you when you were just a dying bat, but you certainly turned out fine. Just a dying bat. That's a weird way to describe that. Off with you then. Build up your skills and then come back and show me how strong you become. Thank you, Granny. Thank you. You're kidding, right? Coming along with us won't be any fun, you know. Yuri, you do want to know who I really am, don't you? Well, yeah, I do, but... If you let me come along, maybe I'll tell you someday. Son of a dots. Fine, do whatever you want. It's settled then! Thanks for letting me come along, everybody! Huh? Uh, what is it, Granny? Here you are. This is for all of you. Got a Solomon's Key. King Solomon's Key. Selecting Solomon's Key from the second page of the command menu displays an old map and a book entitled Solomon King Solomon's Key. Place the crest in the correct positions within each region to release the crest power and add to the crest magic you can use? What? From the second page of the command menu. What's this? I did some digging on my own, you see? And that's when I found that book. You did some digging? When in the world did you do that, Granny? Hee hee hee, I just... I had to find out what was down there. But the only thing I found was that old writing book. I wish it was something more valuable. Oh my, well this is incredible. 
You mean you know what that book is, Geppetto? No question about it. It's King Solomon's Key, one of the lost great black books. Uh, this book contains a map of where the 72 demons that were controlled by King Solomon lived. You know those crests we've been collecting along our travels? Crests? Oh, you mean those things I got absolutely no use for? Those the crests you mean? Hehehe, <laughs> you don't have to pout just because you can't equip them, you know. You're just a big baby. Hmm, shut up. Uh, excuse me, I'm talking to you folks, and I'm about to say something very important, kiddos, so listen up. Uh, they say that if we place the demons that dwell in these crests properly, we can unleash great magical power. Oh, I get it. They place the crest on this old map, right? But how do they know where to place each crest? Well, that's the question, isn't it? Maybe we could guess based on each demon's preference and characteristics. But the trip ahead is long. I'm sure we'll figure it out eventually. So not getting that crest on the lotto may actually hurt us because without all the crests, we're not going to be able to get all the magics. Granny Lot, this is a true treasure indeed. Thank you very much. You're certainly welcome. I hope it'll be useful to you. Well, good luck out there, everybody. I'll be praying for your safety. All right, let's take a look at this, shall we? Solomon's key. By the way, combo magic is here. Looks like we have a lot of them. I don't... I... The specials here, it's... Yeah, it's just one of those things where I'm pretty sure if you have it all set up right... But chances are I'll probably forget because I don't play this game, you know, hour after hour after hour after hour. If I did, it might be helpful. Uh, Crestless. Chain C. So I have no idea. Yeah, I have no idea how this exactly works. Oh! Okay. So I put on all the earth ones. Nothing happens. You gotta put them in a certain order, I think. Can't just put all of them down. But I have seven green ones. So... Hmm, hold on. Alright. Andros, the dark angel with the head of a raven. Decide war and duels between men. Romantic tragedies. Um. Well, romantic tragedies could be either one of these two, right? No, this is a play. And a tragedy is a type of play. Um, coastal forest. So that's either here or... It's gotta be here because the water is to our right. Uh, lives with beautiful woman at the lake's edge. It's gotta be here. Forest. Uh, swimming in the lake loves his neighbor, Gremory. Um, well, swimming in a lake, that's got to be here.
here? The Saints only means a Vasago, near to whom he has built his mansion. So Vasago's there, so Zephar has to be here. And Furfur here. Lives by Grammar in North Forest. So it has to be here. There's Grammary. Um Tent. All, all the first passion crests are in the correct order. Cure has been newly added to the Furford crest. Bright Light has been newly added to the Grammary crest. Hellbreak has been newly added to the Andrus crest. Rockra has been newly added to the Zephyr crest. Red Wave has been added to the Zitri crest. And Galespin has been newly added to the Celos crest. Evil Ray has been newly added to the Visago crest. Oh, fantastic. So we can power up our spells once we get all the crest. That makes me want to go get that missing press that we're missing. Um, I just said missing twice, I know. So now I have a lot more magics. I have cure. Um. Gale spin. Wow. That does so much. Bright light. Wow, that does so much to your power. Holy cow. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna probably have to try to go get that Missing crest from the lot of member. I hate to do it, but the but the way these system You know works You kind of need to have all the crest or otherwise you're not going to have You're not going to have um You know all, all of your uh, potential and considering that each crest is magnified it's it's a big difference. I'm gonna try once legitly Wow nowhere close all right, well, I'm gonna go ahead and get that crest and in the next episode we'll uh, uh We'll talk about what the bathing crest is. I did wait though at least until after we You know done that dungeon to try to get this crest so we didn't have the power of this crest then uh, but yeah, apparently finding all the crests is going to be super duper important. My name is Fuzzbur. This is your Floyd's story-based gaming channel. Flory based Flory? Where did Flory come from? Anyway, yeah, this is our blind let's play Shadow Hearts 2 Covenant. Uh, thank you for everything, my friends. Love you all so very much. And until next time, so long and take care. Thank you for watching this video. Feel free to comment on what you saw and what you would like to see next. I always love to hear your thoughts. Please be sure to like and subscribe for more. Also, please do not forget, you matter, you are brilliant, and you are loved, and you should always remember to be true to yourself. Don't let the world tell you any different. Much love to you from your friendly feathered flightless bird. Till next time.